Hey everybody, it's Monica. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. I appreciate you all for being here. Now I just want to start off by, I know I haven't been on YouTube for the past five or six weeks. I want to apologize for that. And I didn't even know if I wanted to film an intro for this because it's been a very rough several weeks. Um, my mom passed away at the end of January and it's just been very difficult, not just in my personal life, but with work as well. So this isn't going to be a very long video. I just want you to see, of course, you can tell I've kind of moved some things around back here. Uh, but that's the reason. If you if you guys ever are curious why I'm not on YouTube or I haven't posted anything, look on the community tab. I did post there a couple weeks ago that um, I wasn't going to be putting anything up. I'll be honest, I just haven't felt very inspired or really just... Um, had any motivation to do any kind of crafting or filming uh, at least that um so i apologize for that but um in the midst of that i felt like i needed something to kind of push me out of that funk if you want to call it um just to feel more inspired um as you can see i got a new desk back here so i moved some things around so the video is very short maybe about 10 minutes just showing you what i decided to do um so stay tuned stick around and that's coming up next well, you guys, I've gone and done it again. Look at this mess. I know, I'm indecisive. I get bored right away, but that's not really the reason. All this side's pretty much staying the same. It's this corner. I took down my glitter wall because this desk is way too big for this craft room and I am bursting at the seams. So I actually ordered a corner desk that's going to go on this corner. So I took down my glitter shelves. I'm patching up the nail holes and I'm going to sand and repaint. Luckily, I still have a little bit of paint left from when I painted my room when I initially did my... Um, makeover and i think this is called uh lily lilies in the field i don't know uh but anyway um so i'm not going to film you know uh of me organizing and doing all those things but this side is the side that's really gonna get the most uh makeover so i have to shift some things around i'm even thinking about putting my heat press there and moving my Cricut cart over here so I have a little more open space on this side by my door. So stay tuned, you guys. This is just the before. Um, it is a, a lot of a mess right now, but I do need to do some organizing, just some personal things that have been happening that I haven't really been in here. And then I decided to, if I'm going to get in here and get re-inspired, I need to start with a newer desk, a little more compact in the corner. So we will see you in the next right, clip, guys. you guys. So here's the update. I've moved that desk out of there because I'm supposed to be getting my new one either tomorrow or Monday. I've already painted and patched up the holes, or should I say patched up the holes and painted. This unit right here, I'm probably going to shift over here. And the corner desk will go right there. And then I'll probably put my glitter wall right there up there sorry i'm uh not sure how zoomed in or zoomed out i am but uh that is the update i'm gonna let this paint dry i need to measure so i'll know where to shift over the uh this unit but more than likely i will put my uh right here is where i had my uh heat press right right here by the door this is all the same i'll put my uh cricket little cart right here and then that unit and then I'll have my uh, desk on that corner. So that is the update. Once I have a little bit more to show you, I will do that. Otherwise, you will see the big reveal at the end. Okay, you guys, as you can see now, when you walk in the door, I have the unit right here with my Cricut stuff right there. I measured out the measurements of the desk and, it, and of the new corner desk, and it's supposed to come out to this corner. Now... <laughs> My dilemma is that I'm not sure if I'm going to have room for this. This was on the side of uh, 
this unit and it fit perfectly on that corner so i'm hoping that i could still do that but i'll have to tackle this after i get my um corner desk i'll put a picture of what it looks like uh when i ordered it but um yeah and it's not going to be fun having to tackle all this because i was measuring um my glitter shelves and they're 24 inches across so it would literally be like right where this cricket card is right here because i can't go beyond that line so i'm gonna have to figure that out um but i'm looking forward to it i it, it's a corner desk with the hutch at the top where i could actually store a few things so that's going to be helpful as well i'm hoping to get rid of a couple things that take to my basement that i don't use very often but um it's a nice and bare clean wall now. I'm going to leave that sign up because the, the hutch only goes up uh, 60 inches. So I'll still be able, I might still be able to hang something up there. But we shall see. Um, but that is where the progress is. I do like how this looks right here. It feels like there's a better flow in here. But we shall see. Stay tuned, guys, for the next clip, which could be tomorrow or the next day. Okay, guys. Not completely done. I still need to finish hanging some of my pictures. But um, as you can see, I have my heat press over here where my Cricut rolling cart was. Everything pretty much is the same here. I did move my glitter wall over here. So I didn't have to take my pictures down on that wall. But uh, oh well, I'll, I'll figure out what to hang there. But uh, I'm not crazy about having those things right there. But for now, it'll work. Um, of course, this is the new piece, this desk with the little hutch up on the top. And it has storage back here, which is hidden. It's nice. It's away. I like that. And um, I just need to hang some of my pictures back up. I did move my picture that I had hanging on the other wall. But now that I have this, I might have to move it over so it could be a little more centered with my Cricut uh, but for now, I'm just going to leave it. Um, but yeah, I, I feel like there's much better flow here. I mean, it feels so much more open. I don't have the heat press out here. It literally came out to like right there. Plus, the desk came out a little more than that. So I feel like it's so much better flow. It feels bigger. But I'm not going to go back and show you everything that's in there because you guys have already seen that. I just want to show you the the layout. And aside from that, show off this little... Look at that, you guys. LED lights. That'll have a nice little ambiance for when I film, right? Um, so I'm excited about that. I'll have to test it out. But that is a quick snapshot. Well, there you have it, you guys. Just a quick little craft room update. It wasn't a whole lot. It was just pretty much this corner. Um, and then, of course, moving my glitter wall over to the other side. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed. I know I constantly keep moving things around. But I felt for me, I needed to a change. I needed to do something. I do feel a little more inspired. I have recently, probably in the last week, made about a dozen Chiefs Super Bowl win t-shirts. And that's kind of pushed me over my... Uh, little hump that I've been trying to get over. So thank you to everybody who has ordered those for me. I truly, truly appreciate it. Uh, but that is it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed. Not a very long video at all. Hopefully in my next video, I'll have a little bit of... of I, I'm working on some things because I'm honestly trying to get back on the ball and reopening my shop. It's not going to be through Etsy. It's going to probably be my own little online sh uh, store or shop or whatever you want to call it. I'm still kind of in the midst of kind of comparing prices, seeing what's a better fit for me and all that stuff. But I am working on some products so I could have a little bit of inventory when I do decide to open my shop and launch. So um, that's going to be what I'll probably be working on over the next few weeks, just filming content for that. Like I told you, I have not felt very inspired uh, to film much lately or do much, if I'm being honest. But uh, that is it, you guys. I don't mean to be a Debbie Downer. It's just been a rough few weeks. So thank you guys for joining me in this video. I appreciate you very much and stay tuned for the next video. Bye guys.